hi guys and welcome to another video so in this video we're gonna talk about the bold data type okay so uh let's get started uh first of all i'm gonna give you guys a background on when we use this data type okay so this data type we have a name okay which is bull which means that we could have a data type that can that can only takes uh two uh, variations or values okay uh, so we we'll use this data type when we are dealing with conditionals or statements and we basically need to take a decision or make a decision okay so let's create a variable that we very that we very understandable so uh, let's create a variable called is alive okay and is alive means that it is a state okay we only have a state so the bool variable can accept two states one of those states is true okay and the other one is false so as you guys can see uh so let's assign is alive is being equal to true uh and i'm gonna call console right line and i'm gonna pass is alive so this is the code so far. Let's execute. And we're going to see what the output is. Okay. So just keep in mind that. Okay. So let's just regular over here. So you guys can see it shows true. So the other one, uh, let's just create a variable. Anyways, I'm not going to assign any value. As you guys, as you guys can see, the Visual Studio doesn't allows me to do that. If I click execute, it's gonna throw an error, okay? So, but I could create a new variable that we're gonna discuss later. As you guys can see, I can assign as being equal new, which I'm gonna do to see what happened, and I cannot do that because the, the compiler of C Sharp only accept a bool variable to accept one of those states, true or false, okay? So thanks guys for watching this videos. I hope you like it. Don't forget to subscribe and share this video if you like, okay? So I'm gonna finish right here and see you guys next time.